Hello there. It is time once again to talk about The Mandalorian. Are we doing this again? Oh yes, we are. We're doing it again. I just got done watching episode... Uh, episode... Chap, chapter... Chapter 10, The Traveler. Uh, which starts us back off on Tatooine. Um, the Mandalorian is returning to Mos Eisley. Uh, and is ambushed. And I'm not really sure if they were there specifically for the Mandalorian or if it was just kind of like a random happenstance of raiders. Uh, they did mention going after the child, so that kind of lends the theory that, um, you know, they were sent after him. Uh, I don't know. I imagine that's going to be a thing. They kind of mention it later in the episode, how it's dangerous for him to travel. Uh... So yeah, and Moss Eisley, uh, he gets a lead on some more Mandalorians and ends up having to take a passenger to a, well, a passenger that has, well, let's start that over. He takes on a passenger who is a frog, that I call her a frog lady, she looks like a gecko to me, but whatever, uh who needs to get her and her eggs to Trask? I think it's Trask to have her husband fertilize them. Uh, and her husband has said that he has seen Mandalorians. So that's the incentive to travel. Uh, but the catch is, is they can't go into hyperspace because that'll kill the eggs. Um, so, they go forth, uh, they get intercepted by two New Republic X-Wings who basically identify the Razor Crest from the episode last season where they broke into the prison, uh, so the Mandalorian, you know, runs for it, and onto a ice planet where he wrecks the ship, when they crash, and, uh, while he's trying to fix it, they run afoul some local f fauna, like these spider things, uh, that threaten to overrun, you know, basically, it overruns them, and they're trapped in the cockpit of the Razor Crest, and they're eventually saved by the two X-Wings that chased them down on the planet, who, uh, you know, af you know, kind of do sex machina, uh, sorry, uh, do sex machina, kind of, uh, you know, hey, we saw you actually did good stuff when you broke into that prison, so things like that, and so I kind of sort of pardoned him on that, and, uh, the episode ends with them, you know, the damaged, very damaged Razor Crest slowly, uh, flying away. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was an episode, uh, I don't think it's fair to say that it's not an enjoyable episode because it was good. There was a lot of good things in it. Uh, the character design was great. Uh, we had the, the frog lady that was tremendous. Uh, we had, uh, at the start, we had this giant, like, mantis person, which is, I think it was either Dr. Mantid or Dr. Mandible. Mandible. Either which way, it's just glorious. Uh, the spider creatures were pretty great. Uh... But I don't know, I mean, I feel like that's just the very definition of a filler episode. Um, slightly concerned, because the child definitely crossed the barrier between very cute and adorable to annoying. Uh, he spent the entire episode eating the frog lady's eggs. and being just really kind of a obnoxious child about it, which I guess is fair. He is a child, well, 50-year-old child, but... 
I don't know, you know, this, some of the storytelling there is just kind of paint by numbers. It, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think, you know, the, the negative reaction I'm having now is more of the case that it wasn't, like, awesome as opposed to it was bad, if that's fair. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of just, you know, we, we're kind of stuck waiting now for another week just to kind of get the story going again, because, I don't know, I, 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 heck, I wanted some resolution, I wanted to see them arriving on Trask, and, you know, her meeting, you know, seeing her husband, which we'll probably see next week, um, it seemed like, you know, they, they did a recap, uh, before the episode, and, uh, Basically, the recap was showing the droid from that episode where they broke into the prison. Uh, just showing that the Mandalorian, you know, shot him. And uh, then the rest of it was the previous episode. Um, and that droid thing was only there just to remind us because at some point the frog lady gets the droid's uh, access, you know, access to the that dead droids uh, translator so she could talk but they only just do it for that one scene and it's just kind of like done so it's just kind of I don't know yeah that's it I don't really have a lot going on otherwise with that um, yeah it, it was you know, it's it's an entertaining it's an entertaining show, it's an entertaining episode, but just this one was just kind of meh, meh. Which is fine; they can't all be winners. Uh, and that's it. I will talk to you guys next week about the Mandalorian. I hope you have a great day. I'm going to keep on doing this. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. So please like and subscribe. Da 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 da